Happy Monday. We have Penny and Barrett's of Winchy Visual Puppies, and these newborn babies are just a week old. So we hear sweet puppy sounds and they sleep a lot. Penny does a great job taking care of them. She's a good mama and keeps them clean and fed. And she is outside in her play yard right now. We might hear her barking a little bit when she hears me talking. But if she was in here, she would be in my lap and wiggling and it'd be really hard to see the babies on the camera. We'll look at each of these babies a little bit. Uh, we're working on our early neurological stimulation. We're making sure that we hold the puppies in a variety of ways. Expel them briefly to a cold surface for a few seconds, touch their paws, hold them on their back. And then we do the early scent introduction where we give them a new smell. Uh, that they get to smell for a few minutes. Sometimes they will turn their face away and sometimes they wiggle their little puppy nose as they smell it. <laughs> Pushing that baby. So we'll look at these babies. We asked for litter theme recommendations for these guys and we had a lot of people suggest Valentine's since it's Valentine's Day right now or candy. So we kind of combined the two and said we'll call this a candy crush litter. We don't call the puppies by these names. They're forever family. We'll give them their real name. But when we, this just keeps us from having five blue boys or five pink girls. So we'll start with our little Merle female. We've got her labeled as Kit Kat. Her nose is pink right now, but it'll darken as she gets older. Merle is referring to the silvery gray with the dark patches. And she's got white markings on her as well. <laughs> this is <laughs> black and white little boy. Uh, we're gonna call him or identify him as was Rolos. He's got lots of spots, lots of white patches. One side of his face is mostly white. He does have a little bit of black around that eye. Right, and then we have our, our little Merle boy. So this is Snickers. Got a lot of dark black patches, white markings in that merle pattern. Just scooting around as I'm moving them here. Our other merle female, we have three girls in this litter. This is Kit Kat. No, this is Baby Ruth. I went back and forth on which one to call Baby Ruth and which one to call Kit Kat. The merle pattern with a lot of dark black patches. So, baby Ruth. Black and white little boy. This is the one we've labeled Andy's. Big white collar and a big white blaze. Then we have our black and white female. It's a little girl we're calling Peppermint Patty. One eye that's white and one that's black. Their noses are pink right now, but they'll fill in. Then our last little boy. Reese's or Reese's? I'm not sure. I kind of say it both ways. His nose is starting to fill in. Got black paws and a black chest. And they're back in their puppy pile again. So they'll spend a lot of time sleeping and growing. And we hope that maybe they'll have their eyes open 
next week or starting to open next week if you want to check back in with these newborn pups and sheep-a-doodle babies at Okoy River Doodles.